first tonight, parents of Fort Wayne school children say enough is enough. At least many of them say that they want the district to cancel classes next Tuesday after hundreds of local teachers say they'll be using paid time off to attend the Red for Ed rally at the State House. Good evening. I'm Linda Jackson and I'm Tom Powell. We're glad you're here tonight and we are focused on the fort and a petition that has gained thousands of signatures in support of closing school next Tuesday. Fort Wayne's NBC News reporter Jeff Newmeyer explains why Fort Wayne Community Schools hesitation to do so is causing some parents to be concerned. A change.org petition pushing for FWCS to close schools Tuesday came up online November 12th, and by mid-afternoon Thursday, look at the number. More than 4,500 people had signed. Sarah Silva, an FWCS alum whose son graduated from Northrop High School, started it, convinced the district's teachers should have the chance to go to a Red for Ed Action Day rally at the State House November 19th without having to use a personal day. I'm very happy to see that this petition is just taking off. Uh, they're just, there are new signatures coming every second. Thousands of school teachers and their supporters statewide are expected to converge on the State House for the Red for Red rally that's designed to push state lawmakers for increases in teacher pay, school funding, and other changes such as less reliance on standardized testing. Fort Wayne Community Schools for now is not planning to cancel classes the day of the rally. At the Bright Point Head Start on Hannah Street noontime, Walter Lewis, who has two girls at Lincoln Elementary School, told us he thinks testing has gone too far. I feel like they need to back off of it a little bit, but I'm all for school closing if they can go down there and get their point across and stuff. It's not like they're doing this for their own personal benefit. They're doing this for the benefit of our children. And that is the most important. Please hear us. This teacher and parent sees the other side of things. I have to figure out what I'm exactly going to do with my kids when, if they're closed. Um, that creates a big problem. I like people speaking up. That's what this country is all about. That's what this school district is all about. Steve Corona says he's getting a lot of emails about this dilemma. We see both sides. It's much more complicated than that. But I think in the end, we're going, the district is going to make the right decision. Jeff Newmeyer, Fort Wayne's NBC. An update now. More than 4,700 people have signed that online petition calling for FWCS to cancel classes on Tuesday. Superintendent Wendy Robinson spent the day meeting with school board members and the teachers union about this, this issue. Right now, plans call for all schools in Allen County to remain open the day of the rally.